Though, of course, we're back with another Pokemon, of course, um, review and stuff like that. I've been doing this in the last couple of days, of course. Hey, Dougie, what's up? The dog's on the chillin'. Um, the carpet, hello. The chillin'. Okay, we're just chillin'. Okay. Um, but yeah, though, um, of course, back with another video and stuff like that. I figured I'll record this one because it is another go episode with him doing you know, the Project Mew stuff, his trials, and his, like, of course, you know, stuff he's going through and stuff like that, of course. Yeah, of course, we did get you, um, of course, screen update, of course, with um, Cinerace, uh, Rookie, uh, of course. I know Surface was on here, and Teleon's on here now, which I kind of saw, and I was like, I have to put it in the video. Like, that auto has to go in. Excellent. Sorry, there's one on my face game right there. So, you got for you guys, it's like, wait, huh? Yeah, for me, it's just like, gotta dab it up a little bit, though, of course. Um, but yeah, um, yeah, of course, we see a little bit of what happened last time, of course. Um, for, I forgot their names. I'm sorry, though, for these two. I completely forgot their names. I keep forgetting. Um, but yeah, of course, we see where, um, where we last left off on the first one. We got Lowland, um, Nine Tails right there, of course. We see him, um, you know, of course, with a distance, make sure it's been safe and stuff like that, of course. They're happy about it. Of course, you know, both the trainers, you know, just going back and forth in their perspectives. We see Ashen go, of course. Um, I might have to put that in the thumbnail, though. I might have to put that in the thumbnail. Um, I don't know, so the saying, like, when we're putting the thumbnail, I think it's recording. I'm still deciding what to put in the thumbnail for the, um, um, for the episodes. I might have to put that one in there, just because I really want to. Um, of course, though, we see Ash go first get the next notification for the, um, the next adventure going on for the Project Mew stuff. We see him, um, I think, I believe, for Ghost, but now he has, like, Golden Scouts from Book Corona. Um, in Universal, of course, you gotta go to that Desert in Unova. I forgot the end of it, though, but I do remember it. The Desert in Unova, of course. So, of course, that was back to Unova, of course, for Ash and Go. And that's where, um, really good. Of course, they go inside the mines. We see, um, I think, one of the, um, of course, you know, um, Researchers, of course, not really researchers of the project new, but we see, um, of course, this guy pop up back and forth. So, like, he discovered, like, a gold, just a full on, just gold room and everything, of course. We see, like, they're actually, like, they kind of explain the situation. But, um, no, 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 no. He uh, makes plans, you know, I guess, like, the skills are broke around and stuff like that. Um, this is Swain going with a story for it and stuff like that, of course. I think I'm just really interested in it more and more and more. Of course, we see, you know, the bar here, of course, getting excited. I forgot. I know it's, I know it's like, I'm like, I think, like, Expedi Expedition, like, researcher or something like that. He's not part of Project Mew. He's just doing his own little thing, though, of course. So, yeah, of course, we see, um, actually go, of course, going to the mines and stuff like that, of course, for the, um, you know, basically, see a whole bunch of back come out. Of course, the super, of course, it goes a little bit, kind of scared a little bit at first. But of course, he just gets fresh kind of going there. Of course, they um, really like to see um, a rock and roller. Of course, uh, we see, of course, Ash and go by the ballot. Of course, and, um, I think Goku's idea to catch it though. Um, where he wants to catch it, of course, you know, force Pokédex and stuff like that. Of course, um, yeah, but then of course, um, Go call out Italian because he is more Italian on screen, of course. Uh, we basically see come with just a one shot um, rock and roller. We see a whole herd come out, of course. The, oh, Go catches rock and roller. We we'll see a whole herd come out. It's good to see Italian on screen, though. Really, really good to see it on screen, showing off what they could do. Even though we already saw it in a debut episode, which actually was really good, though, for it, though, of course. Um, but yeah, though, um, of course, we see Ash and Go, I'm getting to go, um, go my, oh my lord, um, a mine, uh, mine cart. Of course, we see Italian going there as well. Uh, we see him kind of like, of course, go on and crash ahead, though, a little bit. Of course, we see him going through the mines and stuff like that, of course. We see, um, Ash and idea for Pikachu to use, um, there's a Thunderbolt lab, the whole um, underground mine. Because, you know, again, Unibuzz, like, always underground mines and stuff like that. We see, I think, Nito or Nito. Um, I think, I believe he's one of the people who was, um, guarding the eggs, I believe. Yeah, we see a wild full out thorn come in and stuff like that. Of course, Goku's idea to catch it using Generace. Really good stuff, really good. He's catching again. Go for episode episodes, really good though. He's catching a lot of good, just new Pokemon for him. Really good though, of course. We see Nido, I think, really that's his name, with um, Net Researchers. I think just somebody who's guarding the I believe though. I haven't seen, like, I was scrolling the episode, I didn't really see that much of it though. So yeah. Uh, of course, they, they introduced themselves. Basically, he was guarding, I guess, the larva, or larvata, not larvata, but larva um, eggs. I forgot the name of, um, what was it, Larvesta, Lar Larvesta. Guarding Larvesta eggs, of course, uh, we see him, um, basically just kind of explaining, over, I guess, being, like, really, really good value. And, of course, it basically is a trap, I believe, though, so, yeah, I kind of saw it. I was like, wait, what? I saw a little bit of this, so a little bit, though, so, of course, scrolling through. Of course, we see he calls, he calls um, a Carvantula, of course, whoops up Ash and Go. Um, basically, you know, of course, traps him and stuff like that, so he's basically, he's, I guess, the poacher selling the eggs and stuff like that. Again, it was still weird to kind of see it. When I first saw the episode, I was like, oh, well, that seems like kind of a cool guy, but no. And of course, the Larvesta, of course, um, you know, he tried to get away, and of course, the Larvesta come in. He, um, he tried to go, of course, Gar um, Garbage comes out and stuff like that. Of course, easily just get torched and stuff like that. We see it leave a fire from all the boxes and wood and debris. Of course, uh, what else? Uh, okay, it seems like just went over the debris and stuff like that. Of course, Ash got caught in the crossfire, was gonna be whipped up. Literally about to freaking die, like, just. Just insane this, because again, when I first saw this, I was like, wait, what? I had to like kind of break down everything a little bit, just kind of going over everything. I was like, I had to go over and freaking die over here, man. Pokemon got dark really fast. Besides the movies, everybody dying. Yeah. 
um, in general though, yeah, I was like, holy crap, this is insane, so, really crazy, really crazy, of course, you see Ashigo kind of escaping the fire and stuff like that, using one of the fire, and the fire swept over, of course, the web and stuff like that, of course, obviously, of course, Neo tried to get away, Pikachu and um, Go try to stop him, of course, um, of course, see Ashigo try to um, negotiate with the Lord, that's the same thing that I even want to, of course, go, um, and just calm him down, of course, I get some of the eggs, and manage to calm him down a little bit, convincing them that on their side, of course, we see the wood kind of fire kind of spraying up a little bit. We see um, Go Call and Teleon. Ash calls out Dragonfish, of course, um, using the water powers, of course, or the water abilities, essentially. And Go Call and Lothus Grabby basically to um, basically take out the fire and stuff like that. Of course, Go on um, basically protect the eggs and stuff like that. Of course, after throwing up the water, um, we see a shiny Lord Vesta, I think, come in, I believe, or just a regular Lord Vesta and come in. And of course, evolves and um, um, evolves the book on. I don't think it's shiny though, it might be just because of the lighting in the episode. It might be shiny, it might not be, I don't know. Of course we see um, it absorbs the fire and stuff like that, of course. Um, making sure like nothing else is like spreading and stuff like that. We see the golden scale, of course, the go needs. Patient mission, he gets them and of course they get out in time. Of course, same feeling does she and stuff like that. Of course, they see Nito. Of course, um, right here basically, um, you know, um, basically call the poachers. Like, they're all basically just poachers and stuff like that. They come out, of course, to Ron, Go, and Ash. Of course, while they're, you know, down and stuff like that, of course, you know, with a Pokemon weekend and stuff like that. Perfect time to strike. Of course, we see one of the researchers, of course, both researchers, researchers actually come out, of course, spin Ash and Go off. Of course, but yeah, then of course, we see in the next form of Sharp, uh, a Sharp Foods Evolution. Uh, of course, we see him come out and stuff like that. Pretty good, though, of course. We see it just beat up, though, of course. I know in the first episode, we saw the um, first one guy gave his debut. Even though the battle was really short. Same thing goes for here as well. You know, in the episode, I mean, it focuses on Ash and Go. But in general, though, um, yeah, of course, in the end, we see, of course, the Sharp Foods, of course, both of them, both styles of the Sharp Foods come out and stuff like that. Of course, again, this one's water and fighting, I believe, which I did not know that when I was talking about episode. Of course, again, they do the least. I again, I always wanted to in the, in the end of the episode, though. Of course, this is go, of course, get the golden scales, of course, um, from the corona, I believe, though. Of course, goes a little bit worried and stuff like that, of course, but both of them turn up, um, you know, pretty much, you know, basically going to go on the adventure and stuff like that, basically, something closures and stuff like that. Of course, crazy go, thank you, did good job for him and Ash both, and of course, going on to the next journey of slash adventure, of course. Yeah, pretty short episode though. Um, pretty, pretty not really short, but pretty, um, pretty good though. Of course, we gotta see another another side of the short food. I think we saw both of them in this episode, I believe. Let me check. Okay, yeah, we saw, we saw both of them in this episode. Okay, I had to make sure because they did on the show like everything on here on the side. So yeah, of course, and I thought it was a great Ash after Dragonfish again. So yeah, it was really good to see Dragonfish on screen. Good to see Intellion on screen. Um, I didn't see Dragonfish since like the entire episode though. So if it isn't that, I can probably go back and no, I don't remember. I can't remember, did I? Did I? Okay, yeah, I did. Okay, I, okay, I don't remember. I don't remember. I don't remember. Yeah, it was an episode though. So yeah, I'm pretty sure though. Of course, like I said, I'm um, gonna end it after this. So gonna give my full thoughts and stuff about that. Of course, gonna screw up a little bit. Mm. Oh, please, okay, that So yeah, um, episode was pretty good though. Again, like I said, um, pretty good, pretty simple, pretty easy as well. Of course, uh, again, we got the other side of the shirt food, which I really do love. Guys, see about Corona a little bit more, which is like pretty good though. Like, not shiny, but I won't say it was shiny. Um, I don't know. I, I can I can't really like really see it because the lighting and stuff like that. The episode kind of connects with the flames. Maybe when this comes up, like you know, I'll, maybe when I I'm actually like you know go back and see the episodes and stuff like that, or I'll probably like you know kind of like go back and see everything. Hey, calm down, okay? Hey, yeah. calm down. Huh? Calm down. What's up? You gotta calm down, okay? You're in the video. You gotta calm down. Hey, calm down, okay? Oh lordy. Hey. 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 Oh lordy. Come down, okay? Hey. Hey, come down. Actually. Now yeah, be fun. Oh lordy. Good? Okay. Really? Weird. My dog's being really rude right now. I don't know what's going on with him. He never does like this on video, so, but of course. But yeah, pretty good episode again. Gotta see both sides of the shirt and stuff like that, of course. Uh, we got to see a little bit more, of course, you know, goes adventure via the um, Project Mew stuff, um, both, of the, uh, both of the researchers and stuff like that. I said near the end of the episode that um, it was good to see both styles, so, but we only see it for a little while. Like in the first episode, we see it just a random Reggie ass kind of come out. Um, what I think was pretty cool though, because you know, it was a journal for the trailer, you know, goes to probably meet you. Hey, calm down, okay? Huh. Just give me a second, let me look at the dog. Go, go. Go, go. Okay, that was really weird. Okay, sorry about that. I mean, I'm leaving all the thing though, of course. But yeah, like I said, my dog was being really weird. I'll just leave him out there to do his thing. I don't know. I don't know. But yeah. Um. Again, 
Um, of course, good to see Go doing more Project Mule stuff. It's good to see, you know, some more Yuba stuff, you know, because the Iris stuff is set up like I think it was the best one. But in general, though, I get to see some both sides of the short film and stuff like that, of course. Um, I forgot what I was going to say in the end of the video, but um, the poachers and stuff like that, him being fake and stuff like that, was pretty solid as well. Um, again, some um, good stuff here and there, though, of course, again. Um, I think the flicks, the first one hyped it up so much, you know, the Project Mule and stuff like that, pretty good. But, um, I guess it's all though, again, like I said, that when I was reviewing it and going over for a little bit before the video, kind of getting my words all together and stuff like that, um, I thought it was actually pretty solid and it's all that, of course, like I said, pretty solid, pretty easy. You could see, again, both sides of Shurafu, or, um, of course, both the researchers and stuff like that. I gotta remember the names by heart, I do not remember <laughs> by the end of the series, by ending, like, your last episode and stuff like that. I'm gonna probably know the names by heart and stuff like that, of course, but yeah. See you guys later, though. Thank you so much for watching. Have a great day. Great I'll quit you. Okay? Um, have a great day, great life, all good to begin though, make sure you stay safe, wash your hands, God bless all of you are going out, playing with Madison Total, but really do! Ah! So what did I think about all the info though, of course, you like, it, hate it, I think it was good, I think it was awesome, but I love the episode, pretty good stuff, of course, good to see you go doing more project new stuff, so yeah, see you guys in the video, you know? Peace out!